so um, this little book is a book um, that I did using Cartabella's Snow Fun Collection. And I really like this collection because I love Cartabella. It's got a, um, a nice texture to it. And it also had these sort of vintage -y looking images. So it's got children and stuff, but they are like the 60s look to like, um, for example, some look like the little girl from Frosty the Snowman. It's just vintage-y, um, like you'll see. But anyway, this is Laura's Craft Zone. Um, it's six by six. The pages are five and a half by five and a half. The spine is three inches. Um, I used two packs of paper, um, 12 sheets per pack. And because it's six by six and the pages are only five and a half by five and a half, um, you could probably use six by six pads or maybe a combination of one six by six pad and one 12 by 12. So anyway, um, the collection is called Snow Fun, but this winter time was just a sticker. And um, I didn't have any problems with her tutorial at all. Um, so you open it up. One thing about this um, particular collection is it had no three by four cut aparts at all. And it only had maybe five four by six cut aparts, but the cut aparts were too big for this five and a half by five and a half album. And they weren't all conducive to cutting down. So I did not put in a lot of inserts. I just didn't want to start throwing in inserts um, before I knew it was going to do what I was going to do with the book. Um, but if they had three by four cut aparts, I would have, but you won't see a lot of inserts for that reason. So this is just a little cut apart. This was also a cut apart, and you could see that I had to um, crop it because it was just too big. But that's um, a little cut apart. And they all have uh, their pocket pages, but I don't have anything in there yet because I, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Uh, so you turn the page, and this is a sticker. And this opens like this. And, and there's that little face. You can see how cute they are. They're very um, sort of vintage looking. And this comes down. This is a belly band, so there'll be something here. And this is also a pocket, so something will um, eventually go in there. And this is a little insert. Um, when, one reason I, I chose this book is they had a lot of the, a few of these sort of spreads. And this particular collection, which is typical of Cartabella, has scenes, so I thought they would look cute. Um, as a scene. And then this was a four by six cut apart that I actually had to cut down again to fit. And this opens like this. And this is a tuck spot, so there'll be something there. And this is a kind of gate fold that opens up. And there's an example of one of those scenes that Cartabella does with their collections that I really like. Uh, now, I wouldn't want to cover this with photos, so maybe I'll end up doing a tuck spot in there or something. And this is sort of a little cardinal spread, a little winter bird scene. Um, I do have one little cut apart in here. This is a, or a little photo mat, um, a little pocket down there. And then this just opens into a, um, sort of winter scene. I kind of thought that looked like the sky with stars and here's a little tag. And this is a little tuck spot there. And this is a pocket, which will have something in there. This is just a waterfall. It's, it's all, you know, standard, so I won't open that up. Oops, gotta glue that down. And then this, this little glow paper I thought was cute. This opens this way, and this is the name of the collection that I stuck there. That's a sticker, and this is one of the cut aparts that I ended up cutting down. Cute for journaling, I thought. And then this opens like this. Again, there's that glow paper, which is cute, and then like this, little people in there. I thought that was kind of cute. I really like Cartabella. It um, they really do a nice job with their um, with their collections. And then this is a sticker. This is one of my favorite papers. It's um, little kids doing 
snow angels. And then this opens up, I love that too, and this opens up into a little spread, one of their scenes. I think that the, the houses that I had earlier were the, the top of the scene. And that goes in there. And this is a, um, a tuck spot, so something will go there, or a little side park, pocket, I should say. And then um, one thing I did is I didn't do these very well. Uh, I put the I put the magnet in the wrong spot, but this is sort of the ski um, page, and those little ski people I thought were really kind of cute. And it closes like that, and then the last page opens like this, and this is a tuck spot in there, and then this opens like this, and there's a tuck spot in there. Um, and then, oops, this is the front, this is the spine, that's the back with those little cute little people. Um, so that was it. It was, it was pretty easy to make. It's kind of big because it has six pages, which is, would be 12, you know, 12 sort of sides to do. Um, but that is the book. And I'll just tie that up. And that's it.